Did you know in the winter 20 Salesforce release, both topics and listees got an upgrade? That's right. Let's take a look at some of the features coming to list views and to topics in winter to help your users be really productive. These include printable views on list views and new ways to work with topics both in list views and on the topics page itself. So let's take a look. So we're back in our sunshine chocolates environment and we're going to use topics to track our Q3 priority opportunities because we want not only to track our own opportunities, but also for others to be able to add opportunities to the Q3 priority list as well. So I use Lightning App Builder to add the topics standard component to the page. And that means as an end user, I can start typing that Q3 priority um, into topics and I'll see it bubble up and I can select it or I could create new topics here. But once I've added the topic, I can actually click through that topic link on the component and see the topic detail page. I have a feed which shows me every time the topic's been mentioned in Chatter, but now what's new is I have a tab called Related, and that's every record that has had this topic added via that component, that standard topic component. So when I click into that Related list for View More, I can do some simple filtering if I'd like, but I can see every record that has this topic added. It tells me the object type because I could be using this across different object types as well, which is really useful. Right now we're just focused on opportunities, so it's just showing opportunities, but any uh, page for any object that has that topics component added, you'd be able to display that here. And um, now I wanna take a look at a filtered list of all of the opportunities that have topics added. So I go into my list views, I've got my view all opportunities list view, but I'm gonna go ahead and clone this and create a Q3 priorities list view because this is how I'm going to communicate and track and eventually print um, a list of all of my Q3 priorities. So I've got my Q3 priorities list view created, now let's add the filter. On the right panel, I'm adding my filter and I open that field dropdown, which is usually where we'd filter on different fields to create different list views, but now I have a new option to add topics. So I can say topics includes Q3 priority. Make sure to add your whole string for your topic name here. So I add Q3 priority and when I save that list view, now it's filtered only for those records that have that topic added. And this is awesome, partly because I can take advantage of cool lightning list view features like built-in list view charts um, and other tools like viewing on a Kanban. Everything that I do in lightning list views, I can do now with this filtered topic list. And now I can also print in lightning. So let's say we're going to a meeting and we want to be able to print out a hard copy of everything that's tagged with a particular topic or any list view. I can now click printable view and print right from Lightning. Thanks for joining for that short overview of how you can use topics, the topic page, and also add topics to your list views and print those list views now in winter 20. For all our release highlights, make sure to check out admin.salesforce.com. And as always, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel so you don't miss any videos in the future where we highlight what you can do as admins in Salesforce. Thanks again for joining and I will see you next time. Thank you.